In Sydney, Australia, we have a state Liberal Party government who really has no understanding of the value of culture. In 2014, they passed the ill-conceived lockout laws that literally decimated Sydney's famous music scene and nightlife culture. Now, in a remarkable turn of events, the protest group, Keep Sydney Open, has resigned its efforts to persuade the sitting government and has instead formed itself into its own political party that is running against the state government in the next state elections. A new Netflix docuseries, After the Raves, reveals how an underground music movement, EDM, has blossomed into a multi-billion dollar global business. It's something that the New South Wales Liberal government needs to watch. Outspoken DJ Tommy Sunshine explores the past, present and future of electronic dance music. So I'm spinning the globe to seek out the legends, superstars and underground heroes who continue to push the culture to new heights. Welcome to the world of electronic dance music. People always ask me, so what, what makes EDM so special? I always told them, it's freedom. Music brings out that animalistic side of us and dance music does. Escalated quickly. I was 14 years old when I signed my first record deal. I felt like I was on this kind of roller coaster where I was living the life like up to my neck. Sunshine brings EDM's past to life while engaging by the medium of meaningful conversations with the most influential stars of today and the trailblazers of the future, including Daft Punk, Hardwell, Dirty South, Paul Oakenfield, Afrojack, Fatboy Slim and more. The series follows Sunshine as he travels from Los Angeles, Las Vegas and San Francisco to Paris, Ibiza, Mysteryland and beyond.